Hey guys, welcome to the channel. Check this out. This is a tent for the 2020 and up Jeep Gladiator from LED Factory Mart. Uh, they sent this to me to review, to set up and show you guys. I'm not getting paid anything. They just sent me the tent for the review. So thank you for that. And this is actually a fabulous tent. I, the quality is great. Um, of course, it's plenty big to fit the five foot five beds and like the Jeep Gladiators. Uh, the length of it is 63 plus 20 inches, so it's 63 inch uh, the bed and then the tailgate part is the other 20 inches that's added to it And then it is 65 inches wide and then 67 inches tall So it should be nice and tall on the inside it looks like it definitely is But it fits the gladiator really really good and comes with nice straps to hook it all around I actually don't have the straps tied right now, but I need to do that uh, Of course it has fiber rods like most tents do the pop-up style tent and if you see the video before this, where I took and I set it up, um, it don't take long at all to actually set it up. And that was my first time, so I didn't know actually what I was doing. But it wasn't much to figure it out at all. So the fabric on this tent is the 210D Oxford cloth. And it's got the uh, PE bottom fabric, which is the nice heavy stuff that you would want on the bottom. So you don't tear, keeps you dry. Um, one of the coolest things about this tent is how everything overlaps. You can see that it overlaps. And now, a lot of people have a question about on the Gladiators, if you have the roll-up factory tonneau cover, which I do, I don't want to take that off because I want to store things on my tonneau cover. And so I don't want to take my tonneau cover off every time I put the tent up. So I actually, on this video, I went ahead and left the tonneau cover on, rolled it up, set the tent up, and it actually works pretty good. You can see this cover covers it and right under here is the tonneau cover so I rolled it up got the tonneau cover left on there and it actually overlaps over it down between the bed and the cab uh, especially when you get the rain top on which I'll show next uh, to let the rainwater run off and down between the cab and not into the tent so the way it's covered is real good it comes out over your tailgate nice and neat I got the straps hooked up pretty much everywhere I could find and it's got these nice clips to hold the rods in place. And then, of course, it's got the uh, screen on the sides. And it's nice and solid in the front. Everything straps on good. And I just like the looks of it, too. It actually is a real good looking tent. So we can unzip this screen here. And then we'll unzip the tent door here. And the zippers seem to work real good. They're nice and smooth. Huh, the air has blown up the bottom of it. Pushed it all up. But when you notice that the bottom is nice and big, which means it's going to fit in contour to the wheel wells and everything in here good there, it's going down. Uh, because you don't want this tight fitting. You want it where it fits in here real good. So when you put a mattress in here, then you have plenty of room. It's nothing tight. It does have a place to hang your little lantern up there. It has a nice pocket on the side. Uh, it does have a nice place here too. These little buckles here where you can undo the screen and you can roll them down and hook them. So they'll stay in place and not be in your way. But it has a nice opening on top. And the Rainfly actually has some openings on it too, which I'll show you in a little bit. But this is a very, very nice tent. Uh, this bottom is extremely heavy. I mean, I don't think you're gonna have a problem with wearing it. I actually have a horse mat in the bed of my Gladiator under it, so it's it's definitely protected. So we'll see how big this thing is on the inside. Okay, as you guys can see, I'm actually, I'm squatted down right now, but standing up, I am six foot one, and I can't stand totally straight up, but I can definitely stand up good enough to move around good, change clothes or whatever. So super size, I love the size of the tent uh, because it overlaps here on the sides of your bed, it actually makes it wider. And then I have a mattress that we put in here for camping but this ought to be a super setup for going on a big trip and you could actually take this thing and throw it up every day on your truck go for a drive and then come back throw it up take it down in the morning real quick it's nothing to it especially with two people like a husband and wife you can take and put this thing together in no time have it set up and ready to go so super super nice i really like this all right, so on the side here, we have a nice pocket for a cell phone. Nice and big, you can put your cell phone, your glasses, your keys, all your stuff at nighttime in there. Then we have the open up here, let some air in, open these screens and cool. We take and just roll this thing up. 
and then take these little loops right here these little hooks set it just like that and now our curtains are going to stay nice and down open where we got the good screen uh, we got the vent on top so lots of air to come in here very nice okay and here it is with the rain cover on and the rain cover actually wasn't too bad to put on uh, my Jeep's fairly tall so it made it kind of hard to reach up over but with two people would have made it a lot easier other than that it pretty much clips on the same way as your tent uh, with the straps same kind of straps and fits real nice and it definitely covers real good down over the side which is important and it covers down here so all your rain off the front part here will run down between the cab and the tent which is what you want so otherwise check this out it's got a little vents here on the side so if you have the uh, screen open on the inside and these little stands right here that holds these out so even with the rain cover on usually when you put a rain cover on you don't get no air well with these and this little thing here at least you get some air when it's raining uh, to keep it more comfortable inside and you can see how it covers all of this it covers the tail light and everything now you may take this part here and pull it out over the tailgate i'm not sure uh, that's just the way i got it now but a person may be able to do that and make it better but otherwise that's the rain cover fits real good uh, makes it not look bad at all uh, i would actually tie all the straps up too to keep them out of your way all right guys so there is the jeep gladiator tent from led factory mart very nice tent very well constructed sets up super simple i will post a link to this below in the description where you can check it out thank you guys for watching click the thumbs up subscribe to my channel and i'll catch you on the next one right on